Dolphins 2010, Barry Butel alongside Cameron Wake. First preseason game. Evaluate your, your performance. Um, it was a lot of fun, you know, most of all. I, I finally get out there and hit somebody else a different color. You know, I'm tired of looking at these ugly guys on offense all the time. But um, no, I just got to get out there, play with you guys, hit somebody different, and come away with a win. Is it a good benchmark, you know? You go with it against these guys every day in practice, but now you're going full speed against another team. I think so. I think um, most importantly, like I said, we're out here battling against each other. Um, the competition is great. You know, you get, I, me personally, getting the best offensive line to go against. I know the receivers, they're really putting a lot of pressure on our DB. So, like I said, getting better and then finally getting out there and playing with each other as a team against somebody else, I think it just show you where you are. How much in that position can you kind of freestyle in regards to just do what you do? Or do you play off maybe some guys alongside with different moves and, and you know, different stunts that you work together? Well, you know, it's a little bit of both. I think uh, with Coach Nolan, you know, he's definitely put together a package that lets guys play within their, their strengths. So, you know, you got a guy who's using speed and power, and they're going to make sure that when their number is called, that's what they get to show. And, uh, you know, playing off of guys on, on the left and the right of you, that's the same thing. You know, having a lot of fun going out there doing that, too. So it's all about. What do you uh, take now into the preseason game number two? Where do you want to be? How do, how do you want to feel after it's over with? Well, obviously, we want to win. That's always going to be the first goal. But um, every day is going out there and improving. We, you know, we won, but obviously, a lot of things on tape that we had to improve, you know, things we wanted to fix, and that's what we've been working on this week. And then, like I said, taking those things that we learned on tape or on the field and applying them in the, uh, the next game. You feel like this defense really starting to click a little bit? I think so. I mean, I think it's been something like from the offseason. As soon as Coach got here, you know, a lot of guys in a lot of new positions, you know, with the retirees or trades or people moving on, you know, a lot of young guys stepping up, hungry for that ball, you know, feed the wolf. And uh, I don't think everybody's coming together. Everybody feels the same way, and we're going to get after it. Do you feel the heat? Do you feel the pressure that, hey, you got some shoes to fill here? You got, this is your time. There's the, the lane that's wide open and ready to take it? Definitely. You know, we had I have four big shoes to fill. I mean, we had, you know, we, like I said, obviously, you know, Jason Taylor and Joey Porter moving on, and then Big Ferg retiring. I mean, like I said, a lot of guys stepping up to fill those shoes. And, uh, you know, I just want to be one of them. Good luck, Saturday. Thank you.